Lord. Now, everybody else has talked about you. And everybody else has said whatever they wanted to say. But it's my time now. And everybody that have two feet in the house, I want you to get on them. And we're going to make so much noise in here, we're going to shake something. Amen? Because we want you to know that we're here with noise. We're here with praise. We're here with laughter. We're here with prayer because we love you. Amen? So, Brother Ed, give us some music that we can just praise the Lord for our dear, sweet, sainted mother, Norma L. Burrell. Come on, let her hear it. Amen? with seeking God. Seeking Him. Psalms 9 and 10 says, and they that know thy name will put trust in thee. How many know you got to trust the Lord every day? It isn't I trust Him today and not tomorrow, but this is continuous. We have to trust Him at all times. We have to seek His face at all times. We have to admonish Him and lift Him up at all times. Amen? And it says, Thou Lord, has not forsaken them that seek thee. He has not forsaken us. When we're going through, when mother was going through, the Lord didn't have his back turned on her. He was just watching her, looking at her being built up, looking at her being edified, looking at her going forth and coming out how? As pure gold. Amen. She has polished some of our characters and probably didn't even know it. She don't know all the things that we're taking in from her. But every time you open your mouth, we listen. You might not think we are mother, but we're listening. And we're holding on to the words that fall from your lips because I believe that God gave those words to you. Women of God, if we're going to be anything in this church, we must get arm ourselves around the mothers that are seasoned. Don't get with the silly women that won't teach you the word of God. Get with somebody that's going to point you to Jesus Christ and tell you that maybe if you can't do this and be in the church. See, some women, they want to tell you, it's all right, God understand. God understands sin. He don't understand nothing else going to heaven. Amen. If you sin it, you're not going. So you better understand, God understands and sin. Praise God. Mother Morel, we love you. And we see that you meet Jesus every step of the way. We need some more of you among us. We need some gap dwellers. Somebody that'll get in the gap and won't move until they get a word from the Lord. We need some gap dwellers that will stay there until somebody ring the phone and say, the circumstance has changed. We need somebody to get in the prayer and say, maybe you can make it. That don't mean, man, if you stay there and pray, God will change it. We need some women that will tell us what to do, how to do it, because they have done it. Not because it sounds good, but tell us because they
Thank you.